Hi, Katie McRae here, and I just wanted to let you know a little bit about creativity. You guys might know that I'm uh, offering a class on it soon, but as I've been researching it and thinking about it, what I'm realizing is I don't know, I think people have different definitions of what creativity is. I think some people think it's kind of like um, making a lot of stuff and posting it on Pinterest, like, you know, making a bunch of really fancy cupcakes for a kid's birthday party or kind of being a Martha Stewart type and making a very fancy centerpiece. To me, that's not necessarily creativity. To me, that's more kind of being crafty. Uh, you might be creative, but I've really been delving into this a lot lately and why we should care about it. You know, why be creative with your clients? Why be creative at all? Like, why is it important? Uh, can everybody be creative? And a couple things came to mind. So I'm gonna read to you, for example, um, the sort of textbook definition of creativity. I've got it right over here. So one of the sort of official definitions of creativity is the ability to perceive the world in new ways, to find hidden patterns, and to make connections between seemingly unrelated phenomena and generate solutions. Okay, so if you are anybody that I know, you do this stuff all the time, especially in your work. If you're a therapist, you are constantly making new connections. You're making new connections for your clients. You're trying to help them build insight. You're problem solving. You're doing this stuff all the time. So you are by definition being creative. It doesn't necessarily mean, you know, you're drawing a mandala or you're painting a picture. You are being creative in your life. Um, another reason I think it's so important, not only, so for me, my definition of creativity in my life has a bunch of different ways that it shows up. One way is crafting, you know, one way is making stuff and painting and, you know, making jewelry or beading or especially knitting and crocheting, stuff like that. So to me, that sort of craftiness is part of my creativity. I think of creativity as that first definition and also making stuff, just physically making something, you know, making a line on a piece of paper to me can be creative. Um, and the reason it's so important, I think, for us and for our clients is we teach, you can teach your clients. You're trying to get your clients usually to be more creative in their lives, to think differently, to solve problems, to come up with new solutions and insights. And so even if you don't consider yourself a creative person, you might actually be a creative person. It's just not that you're necessarily, um, you know, cutting and pasting collages every day after work. You may be creative in ways that you didn't know, and you're actually probably trying to foster and teach that creativity to your clients. Now, um, to, in terms of this course that I'm offering, I've had a lot of people ask, you know, do you have to be an art therapist? Do you have to be a therapist? No, I have people signing up who are teachers. I have people who are um, other kinds of educators. You can be um, just anybody who works with someone. So. Uh, chaplains, nurses, stuff like that. So it doesn't necessarily have to be a therapist. Also, uh, a lot of my interventions, so I've worked for years doing this stuff with groups, but I'm also doing stuff like this with individuals. So if you do one-on-one -on -one practice, some of these things, we're gonna work together to figure out how to make it work on for one-to-one -one clients. And I've already had uh, some success with that too, so I'm gonna share that with you. Um, the last thing I'm going to say is I'm hoping that people register by Saturday. Actually, I'm not hoping. I'm telling you. Register by Saturday. The class starts Monday night. Again, if you miss a few classes, doesn't matter. It's all going to be recorded on Facebook Live. And this is never going to happen again. It's crazy cheap. I'm only going to offer this this one time because we're co-creating it. This is the first time that I'm going through this. So there's going to be some glitches, but it's also going to be amazing because I'm going to deliver so much more content than $38, I promise. And it's a money back guarantee. So if for some reason you're like, mm, not feeling it, I will happily refund your money. I would much rather have you be happy and come away with something from this training than make a buck. And I just, I'm so excited. Like I've had so much positive feedback. It's like Christmas. Like I've been wanting to do this for so long and now I finally am. So if you have any other questions, please feel free to email me, k-a-t-y at k-a-t-y-m-a-c-r-a-e dot com. And at the end of this video, I will also include a link uh, to a registration on my website. So you can go ahead and do that. And in the meantime, I'm here to help you make cool stuff.